my home. They did not advise me who they were. They did not say why they were taking me away from home or where they were taking me. They kept me in communicado detention uh, from that day up to yesterday evening when they took me to the airport and forced me to board a KLM flight to Amsterdam, to Toronto. So you were you uh, held in your own home? I was, no, they abducted me from my own home. And where did they, they, took where, where did they take different you? Look, they took me to all manner of locations. They took me to at least six police uh, police stations. The first station was Kiambu Police Station. The second one was Gitung Nguri Police Station. The third one was Lari Police Station. The fourth one was uh, Inland Container Depot uh, Police Station. Um, the fifth one uh, was now the airport. But in between, they took me to Kajiado, uh, purporting that I'm supposed to go there and answer charges. When the judge ordered them yesterday to take me to court in Nairobi, um, they, they took me to the runway at Jirumo Kenyatta International uh, Airport, uh, kept me there for more than five hours until the flight left. And did they tell you what charges they were planning to, to lay against you? Well, at first they claimed that because I am the one who commissioned the oath of uh, Rael Odinga as the people's president on the 30th of January, they said I assisted Rael Odinga commit a capital offense, which is treason. But then, because they had kept me in communicado, I, I had no access to a lawyer, did not know what was happening. I told them I not take the plea. I cannot even sign their statement. Uh, because it was incomprehensible to me how, as a lawyer, commissioning an oath which I'm licensed to do, I had committed capital offense. So then they turned around and said, look, but you are also uh, a self-proclaimed member of, of an organized criminal group called NRM. Uh, I told them, well, <laughs> NRM is not an organized group. It's a movement. It's an idea. And NRM, the Ugandan organization, is the one you have banned, not NRM Kenya. And there is no proof that I'm a member. In any event, I'm not going to sign your charge. So then they turned around and uh, they said, oh, um, I was in Kenya illegally and I, I'm not a Kenyan. Um, and they deported me.